okay, I'm back, and now here it is. I have an absolutely silent Java, and I've absolutely I've done nothing. So do I have a solution? No. I had a temporary solution, and something happened at the point where I pressed the pause button to cause this to behave differently than the normal. <laughs> right? So something happened. Now I bet you now maybe let's see. I wonder if I renamed the live J sound Alza file if I wouldn't have that problem anymore. But first I'm just gonna restart Firefox and see if this is intermediate. Now it was downloading an upgrade to my download helper program or at least was getting some notification. No, it's... and then, yeah, it just installed, so let's see what happens. I'll try going back to Pogo. Let's see what happens. It's just kind of weird. Now, there was one good post that I found. I guess I'm gonna get all those things back out of the bin. Um, you can go into your Java control panel, you can get it to log um, what happens in a verbose manner, and so um, perhaps I uh, these logs, whatever logs it produces, it'll tell me what's happening, what the failures are or, or not. I can also poke around in my home directory and look in the Java cache and the IST cache and see. Actually, not the IST cache. Okay, so I got sound again. Let's test this. Let's see is if if sound goes away if I pause require me to restart Firefox and that's the solution and then try to figure out why that is the way it is. No, no sound there. See now I've got the kind of sound that I had earlier. So now the Open GDK seems to make slightly little to no difference at this stage. Earlier on in this presentation it seemed like the Open GDK was the solution. I don't know what to call my videos. Is I want to call it solved, partially solved, maybe solved, what? So here we are. I mean, these you know, this whole time I should be hearing some kind of music for the game, first of all, like I did earlier. And I should hear, like when that guy hit that little doggy up there, he should have went, oh, but he didn't. So I'm really wondering. Let's see. Let's just see. Okay, so let's go in. I'm gonna go here as a root. Or should I poke around in my home? Okay, let's hope poke around in my home folder, and let's view the hidden files so I can see the folder that contains Java. And there's a .java file, and in there it should have a log. But there is no log. <laughs> now I saw. One of these posts, there's a system, let's see, is it OG policy tool? What's this? <laughs> View warning log, what is that doing? File not found exception, Java policy, no such file. Alrighty. So that doesn't do anything for me. There should be another one for Sun Java. There we go. Plug in the control panel and see what that does. Um, can view my temporary internet files. I just got a bunch of. What's this? Sound BTNAOLE. What the heck is that? show that file and you'll be able to see it or is this just a okay um, what happens if I remove that this is sound B T N A O L see what happens okay I removed it now do, am I in I'm not in okay so I'm not in um, Pogo let's see if that me it may just be that God, I hope it is. I mean, there'll be so many different things. I could just sit here and ponder for 
for a long time. Let's see. I love working with animals. But now, the problem with what I just did there with muting it, although it's better for me, to, you know, for me to be heard actually, but that may have an impact on the way sound works in Java. I don't know. Is it Java? Is it Flash? Let's find out. Well, let's see. You'll see now I don't have any sound. None. Now is it because I deleted that resource? Well let's find out. Let's go back here into the um plug in control panel. Let's see. I still don't think that I have. No, I don't have that that file there. No applications. What about deleted applications? Now, why isn't that showing up? Well, okay. Now let's see. Let's see. We got advanced. Now let's go to debugging. I'm gonna um, enable the logging here. Start this thing over again. I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna go back to balloon bounce. Now this is the directory where the log file is, and if the logging works, and hopefully I'll be able to get some kind of meaningful feedback as to what's happening when I go into Pogo and I get no sound. Now hopefully I didn't disable sound forever by removing that one file that was in the resources area. I may have to rename my .java file just to see, you know, it's, it'll recreate it, I think, <laughs> when I go back to Pogo and then I'll see what happens. Come on, move minutes. We're running out of time. Okay, so I got sound. Now one thing I'm going to do is I'm going to see if that file that I deleted is in there. I'm getting the intermediate, intermittent, not so great sound right now. No. Okay, so that that's really not <laughs> that's not a solution. Okay, so let's go back. Let's close this. Let's see if when I go back to my control panel, I have first of all I'm gonna check a few things, but let's see if I could look view at my temporary files. Now something was called sound or something or other. Let's see. And um I don't see it. Next thing I want to check is the log folder. Oh, I got now I got some logs. So let's see what's going on here. This is saying that server port, waiting connection, blah blah blah. I don't know if that means anything. It doesn't really jump out at me as being a sound thing, but I'm gonna print it out anyway. And let's look at this plugin trace. Okay, value sun x blah blah. God, there's a ton of stuff in here. What's this? signers now what I could do is I could probably just uh, click on the magnifying glass and search and maybe I'll do sound oh looks like so sound player voodoo off now what the hell is that what is what is sound player voodoo off what is that I've see, I saw that before in my ice T uh, directory. What does it mean? Now, sometimes programmers uh, <laughs> make programs. Uh, maybe they're, you know, we don't know how the sound works. It just kind of works. So we call that voodoo. It could be something like that. I don't know. Uh, let's keep looking for the word sound. Sound button ping jar activate location for path. That's just an image. 
splash.au what's this archive location for path uh, applet event thread rank is new rank false name follow I don't know what that means and okay now here we go loaded audio clip click round clock balloon game state play okay so I gotta look these things over <laughs> basically yeah I could also look for something that is error maybe <laughs> I, I'm in new territory here folks so loaded audio clip all include error Well, I don't know. Okay, and there's more log files to look at, too. So, oh, what happened to them all? I'll look for sound. See, I wanted to, like, come up with, like, a real uh, could not load this or that. Or, <laughs> you know, that's what I'm looking for. So the only thing i found so far is sound player voodoo off and that looks kind of sweet. so let me see if I can find anything here about that I'm gonna stop because I don't want to lose this and I am going to continue 